Dalton and Tim Afaro Bailey coming to you from the Trust Stadium here in Waitakere. We're the home team. Yes, the Mystics, your old side, you picked it. They won a 49-44 to 44, and you'd be pretty happy with that win. Oh, very happy. I've backed them right from the beginning and I never faded away. And I, I'm just really pleased that they came through at the end. You know, in the past, last year, they weren't able to finish out quarters, but tonight they just showed what class they have got within their team and what they are capable of in the future. For the Central Pulse, they were slow off the starting block. They led after the first quarter, led the second, led the third. But when you look at the break, break it down, their defence really kept them in their game. Oh, most definitely. But I did think they did take a wee while to get that, their mojo back, as you would say. But when they did, it was great. Arma came around and she's very athletic, she's very fit, and she's got guts. She's another English international that played outstanding out there tonight. I guess when you're for the defenders you can only ask for so much. When they get the ball, I guess it was down the other end that they really struggled to finish it off, wasn't it? Yeah, most definitely. Uh, the Pulse had four more attempts than the Mystics, but the Mystics won by five so that just shows you how important getting those goals in counts. For the Mystics, coach Deb Fuller mixed up her lineup in the defence. Sulu Tonu Fitzpatrick, she got the nod, but come on at, in the second half, Timelissi Fokahokatel, she really made an impact when she came on, didn't she? she? We've seen her come on as an impact player last year. This year she started in the first three rounds, but she did. She did make an impact. But what the outsides did so well for her was they set up her strength, which was coming out to hunt the ball. Look at that. That's guts, determination and desire that she's showing out there. And as a teammate, that's what you want to see. It gives you that more confidence to do everything and do everything well. Yeah, she certainly is an explosive player. Well, let's take a look at some of the numbers. Bobby, what sticks out for you? Well, like I said, the attempts, the Pulse had four more attempts than the Mystics, but they lost by five. And the other thing that does stand out is 85 penalties to the Mystics. Two Pulses only had 70. Well, there it is. The home team finished with a 49-44 to win over the Central Post. Until next time, have a good one.